What is going on guys? DBG here and today we're gonna be doing a gameplay with Paolo Banquero. He doesn't exactly make my team, but he might be good. He might be good. So lads, before we go, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe. We are trying to hit, well, 292,000 subscribers by the end of the weekend. It's actually doable. The way it's going at the minute, it's actually gonna be very, very doable. We hit 292 by the end of the weekend. Who knows, we could fluke the 300k by 2k23. Unlikely, but you just never know. But lads, 610 from Duke. 79 total badges. He says everything key that you need. He's got perfect stats. Or even free throw, which is 85, which is kind of weird. But like, perfect stats, perfect badges, lads. Let's see what price he is. Let's see what price he is, because he could be over the 100. We just still need to get Chet. We still don't have Chet. We did actually manage to pull Paolo, which is a really rare pull. I didn't think he was going to be up rare. He's a buyout. He's under the 100. I think I massively overspent on these guys. No, I didn't. I got him for just for roughly what he was. And I... Yeah, I, I didn't overspend on any of these. I did not overspend on any of these cards right here. So, um, let's go into uh, Freestyle right here. And let's see how we're getting on. So, Paolo Banquero. In terms of movement, he's not going to really dribble that well. He feels sluggish. He feels really sluggish on the ball. His release is nice, though. That Rudy Gay based on very quick is a super underrated release. Like, he's not the greatest release anymore, but it's super underrated. And he's got that high three ball with the fade. As well, his player build looks alright. His player build looks bigger than Jabari Smith's. I'm not gonna lie, I think it like it does look bigger. Um Dunk wise. That might get blocked. I don't know. That definitely will get blocked. That was one that one thousand percent get blocked. So a little bit worried about the dunk packages there. Um, in terms of, what's his escape? Normal, is it? Yeah, it's normal. Freaking Denny escape, I think. Um, he can hit fades, though. And he's going to be a really good catch-and-shoot player. I don't know if that's worth 100k. Unless you're a big Duke fan or a big fan of whatever team he goes to, but... I really don't think that's worth 100k. But, um... I mean, he's worth whatever people are willing to pay, I guess. But yeah, so... Bancaro seems to be pretty nice. Let me green that. There we go, good shot. This is being an alright card. He's not going to dribble much. It's going to be tough. He's going to be very tough in terms of for him to create for himself. He's definitely the worst of, like, the three. The three big rookies, like Chet, um, him, and... What's his name? He's definitely the worst of him and Smith. Like, Chet and Smith are incredible. And he's kind of okay. I'm not going to call him bad, but, like, I'm also not going to call him good either. I'm not going to call him the greatest card ever either. So, I'm going to go and play him at the power forward position here. For everyone wondering why I'm running Gerald Wallace, he's the damn best. He's the damn best. I don't... He's my favorite shooting guard in this whole game. Like, it will take a demigod to get Gerald Wallace out of my team. It will take a legitimate demigod to get him out of my team. And that includes Michael Jordan. I got Hero Jordan. I got Hero Jordan and, ooh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. He's got... He's got Diamond Birdman. Diamond Birdman was good for his time, I guess. I'm just not now, unfortunately. Let's make the dunk. Or draw it foul. Good job. Okay. Not going to press him or anything. The 85 free throw is a little bit concerning. If you if you ask someone real player percentage, it's not really for me because I'm going to time okay. But if you have real player percentage on, that would be a little bit concerning. He either got a 90 on an early though, which is good. Oh, wow. Curry's the damn best. It seems. 
right to the basket. And that's a tough layup for Banquero, but it goes in. Not bad. Not bad for him. Is there enemy with Joe Dumars? Okay, let's let's go. That's a good block. I mean, it was an awful shot by Zion. That was a good block. He's got good length. He showed at least something there. Showed something that his length is good. Um, hop. So he should be open here. Attack Curry. Good shot. All right. He's really running through Joe Dumars. It's a very, very strange player to be running through. Not going to lie. Uh, screw it, fade. Good shot, Bankero. Bank I think it's Bankero. People were telling me I was pronouncing it wrong when I was saying Bankero. Come on, let's go. It's easy block. Let's run. Paddles on the wing. Green that. It's just, against this guy, it's just too easy. I don't know what he threw that for. He's gonna shoot, isn't he? I mean, that's a ballsy shot taking that with Manu Ball on you. That's not, I didn't mean to shoot that. Manu Ball's got wormed by Birdman. Good shot. Good shot. Corner. Good pass there and an easy shot there from Manupo. Come on. Did he shoot? Curry is the best, isn't he? Like so many shots that that Curry's hit are impressive. Oh, he's thrown so far out of play. Oh no. Oh no, that was not what we wanted there. Okay, so he's a sharp take and he can use it. Man, this guy's actually scored a lot of points. He surprisingly scored a lot more than I thought he was going to score on me. He's already scored more than I thought he was going to score for the whole game. Oh no. It's a glass cleaner take. But it doesn't matter because he's going to hit a wide open for him without sharp take. I mean, Rudy Bass is chicken. <laughs> and he's a good player, Billy. He could play small forward. If he could play small forward, I'd be looking at this card a little bit differently. I really would. Okay, that's not a great pass, is it? Corner. Give him the ball. Flick up. I mean, well, he missed. Let's go. Let's go, Jared Wallace. You've been cooked by Steph Curry in this game. I hyped you up and you've been cooked by Steph Curry. And Diamond Steph. Get there on the... Oh. Oh, no. That's all Jabari Smith. Also a little bit of Steph Curry, not gonna lie. That's a good shot. I'd say he's tough to contest. He's tough to contest. That's it. That's it. Wide open. No way. Oh. Good attempt at a rebound, Bankero, I guess. Bankero's player build is way bigger than Jabari Smith's. Like his player build. Is Jabari Smith six nine or six ten? Like Jabari Smith's player build is. They're both six ten. Like Smith's player build, I thought was a lot better than like Wancho's. But like, Wancho's is awful. But like Jabari Smith doesn't look any bigger than Gerald Wallace. So like he looks about 6'7 instead of 6'10. Like there were no way him and Bankero are the same height. And Bankero is way taller than him. Like look, look, I'll set the screen. Bankero is way taller than him. Like Jeffers, Richard Jefferson, I've had him matched up to him. And they've been about the same height. Nope. Good boy. Me that. Oh no. 
went to try to bail out to the corner to fake Lamello. Dyson Daniels is literally just fake Lamello in this game. Oh, Jabari Smith, you're letting me down. You're severely letting me down here. Okay. Come on, let's go. Can't just keep letting me down, Jabari Smith. Okay. Thank you, I was there. Come on. And we've had a, we have a big lead. We've had a comfortable lead. Like we have let this guy score way too many points. For like what he is. He is just shocking. He will shoot anything. And it's, go, and it's going in a lot of time. Like, he greened that. I'm impressed. I'm actually impressed at his ability to score. He just found ways to get buckets. He just, unfortunately, is not the greatest player at this game. And I've been able to score basically every possession on him. Why did I shoot that? I'm definitely shooting that one, though. There we go. About time. Twelve point win there. I'll take it. Nope. There we go. I'm not taking an L right there. I'm not taking an L in that game. But um, yeah. So like, he's gonna be a top three pick in his draft, which is to be expected. He's a really good player. Um, do I think he's the greatest player in 2k? Not really. Um, he's okay. He's fine if you are a huge fan of Bankero. Go and use him. Honestly, if you're a huge fan. Otherwise, I'd probably steer clear. Um, I personally think Mark Williams is a lot better even at power forward. I think Ben Wallace is significantly better. I think the new Horace Grant card is significantly better. I think Fernando's better. Um, I think Josh Smith is maybe better. I think he's just a decent card. He is a decent card, but I wouldn't go like, above and beyond for him. Anyway, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.